Hi, we'll be comparing the tourism attraction of Kenya and South Africa. So both countries are popular destinations for tourists with unique uh, features uh, that make uh, them a standout. In this video, we'll be comparing the tourism attraction of these two countries to help uh, you make an informed decision on where to go for your next vacation. Uh, so uh, in part one, uh, we'll be talking about tourist attraction uh, sites in Kenya. So Kenya is known for its wildlife and national parks and it's one of the top safari destinations in the world. Some of the popular national parks in Kenya include Masai Mara, Amboseli, Asavo and Semburu. The Masai Mara is particularly uh, famous for the annual world-based migration. Uh, that takes place between July and October. So uh, during this time, uh, or during this period, thousands or rather millions, uh, let's say thousand millions, so overestimated. So um, thousands of wild beasts, zebras and gazelles uh, cross Mara River uh, from Serengeti National uh, Park in Tanzania uh, to the Masai Mara in search for the grazing land. So uh, if you wanna witness this uh, spectacular uh, tourist uh, thing, then I guess you should uh, think of coming to Kenya on this uh, particular period of time. During our stay in the Mara, we got to see the last of the largest animal migration in the world, the great wildebeest migration. Every year, more than 2 million animals, mostly wildebeests, but also accompanied by zebras and gazelles, migrate through the Serengeti in Tanzania and the Masai Mara in Kenya, following the seasonal rains in hopes of green grazing land and water. Kenya has beautiful beaches along its coast, including Diani Beach and Malindi. These beaches actually offer a particular gateway for those who want to relax and, and, and wind. So moreover, Kenya has a rich culture or heritage and visitors can learn about the Maasai people's way of life and tradition. Let's say uh, you just have a short like, time within Kenya. Uh, there is uh, things, uh, tourist uh, attraction sites around Nairobi that you can actually uh, come and see or witness. Uh, talking uh, from the Maasai, uh, from the Maasai market where the beautiful art gallery uh, of the Maasai uh, is shocking and sold. We have the Nairobi uh, National Park a park uh, which is located just around Nairobi. We have the giraffe center. We have uh, the animal orphanage which is also around the city. So let's go to South Africa. From giving us one of Africa's greatest leaders, Nelson Mandela, to giving us the popular hit, Jerusalem has sung. There is so much more to South Africa than meets the eye. So, 
So South Africa is one, on the other hand, is one or has a variety of tourism attraction uh, ranging from wildlife to cultural heritage sites. South Africa's uh, most famous national park is Kruger National Park, which is, one, which is the home uh, to the big five animals like lion, a leopard, a buffalo, and rhinos. So the park covers an area of about 20,000 square kilometers, making it one of the largest game reserves in Africa. In addition uh, to the national park, South Africa has beautiful beaches such as Cape Town, Left Horn Beach, which is known for its uh, crystal clear waters and white sand. South Africa also has a rich cultural heritage and visitors can learn about the country's history by visiting places such as the Apartheid Museum in Johannesburg, the Robben Island, where I think uh, this where is this the place where Nelson Mandela was uh, like imprisoned. So uh, let's do the comparing Kenyan South African tourist attraction. So when it comes to wildlife, both Kenya and South Africa offer some of the best safari experience in the world. However, Kenya is better known for the world-based migration while South Africa is famous for the big five animals. Both countries also have beautiful beaches, the Diani, the Clifton beaches, but Kenya beaches are known for their uh, pristine waters and white sand, while South Africa's beaches offer a more diverse experience with some beaches ideal for surfing and others perfect for sunbathing. So in terms of cultural heritage, both countries have rich history. In South Africa, history is better documented and visitors can learn more about it by visiting the country's museum and historical sites. Kenya and South Africa have unique tourism attractions that make them popular destination for tourists, in for tourists. Kenya is known for its wildlife and national uh, parks, while South Africa has a diverse range of attraction, from wildlife to beaches and cultural heritage sites.